Bum 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 The Peter Dislike Show Bum 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 I got a little bit of inspiration from one of my students today. I work as a tutor and um, one of my students was complaining uh, about uh, making mistakes in the problem and working through most of the problem before he realized he had a mistake. He's working on algebra and uh, how much time it, it wastes, right? And I instinctively I thought to myself and then I explained to him, that's not a waste. You got all this practice and um, this is good practice so that you make these mistakes today rather than when you're directing a mission to Mars on mission control someday, right? You'd rather be making those mistakes today, right? And then it hit me, right now as I speak, I'm having a little bit of hesitation on um, asking this girl out on a date. I know she's waiting for me to ask, but I'm having some reservations about it because the last couple of times I dated, I ran into a sunk cost fallacy spiral and so uh, thought to myself, I've wasted so much time, money, energy. Because you got to remember, these days my time is very, very precious. Almost like almost like how I play Bismuth is very precious. My time is like that because of uh, a Computer Olympiad conference that I'm going to, my Bismuth art projects, I'm juggling multiple jobs, and some uh, papers that I'm writing, and also looking for that right person in my life. So I really can't afford to waste any of my time. So I, I spent so much time dating somebody, it becomes I gotta get something out of it, I gotta get something out of it. And as a result, these last couple of dates that I've been on kind of spiraled out of control. And so I've been having reservations about asking this girl out on a date. Now earlier today when I saw my student make that remark about wasting time, it hit me, what I just said to him also applies to me, right? When I go out on a date, and it doesn't work out. I didn't waste my time and money on her. I, I used it to gain knowledge for myself, right? And that's what you do to avoid falling into this downward spiral of sub cost, right? Whatever you're doing, I used to have a friend who had a gambling problem and I watched him chase his losses. He eventually lost everything. Fortunately, he was 21 years old. Everything wasn't all that much, but he lost everything. And so, at any point, he could have said that this was a great experience, I made some uh, connections, and I discovered what gambling is all about, I, I, I learned a lesson. At any point, he could have treated everything he spent up to that point as kind of like a tuition for that life lesson that he learned, right? And uh, it, it could have been a win-win situation, but he lost everything, right? Anyway, so I'm trying to arm myself for tomorrow when I ask that girl out on a date to uh, uh, not go into this... Um, almost it almost feels like the the whole date takes on a life of its own when you get into these spirals out of control spirals and i'm trying to uh stay on top of that before it gets to that point right